And welcome to a game that really should have pulses racing. Every reason to believe this will be enthralling. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson. And hopefully we have explosive action to bring you on this, the 5th of November. Stuart, tell us about your pre-match thoughts. Well, thanks, Derek. Never mind the fireworks going on outside the ground. I'm expecting fireworks on the pitch. It should be a spark of a game, though. Looking forward to this one. The initial 11 today for the hosts. Well, it's a 4-3-3 formation with a centre-forward and two wingers. So it's important that the midfield players give support to the striker whenever the ball goes wide. They can't allow him to be isolated. And this is the initial 11 for the visitors today. Well, it's a defensive lineup, that's for sure. But their wing backs and at least one of their midfield players will need to break forward when they regain possession, just to give them a threat going forward. And so the battle commences. Anderson. Not disappointing for the players of the centre that it didn't reach them. Grot. It's with Lehmanns. Now, let's see what they can do here. Grot. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Grot. Good visualisation and execution. Will he find the net? And not cleared away properly. And there it is. An almost intuitive piece of finishing. Well, when you see this again, I think the goalkeeper's very unlucky. He makes a good initial save, but the ball comes off of him, rebounds straight to an attacker, and the finish is excellent. So underway again here, one nil the score. And a tidy tackle. And they know they need to stop him. And teammates to play it to. Can he take the chance? It looks promising. Can he finish this? Great reflex action. Well, that should have been a goal. Mind you, it's a brilliant save. Clint Lehmanns. And slipped through beautifully. The defender doing his job. 
Well, just listen to the crowd. They know this is a big chance to equalise. And now the delivery. Well, not cleared away completely. Firing it towards goal. No free of difficulty at all for the keeper. Strong play here. And a chance for him on the flank. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the opportunity. Madsen. On attacking possibilities. Options in the centre. Can he put it away? Still a chance. A smart stop here. Trying to deliver it accurately. Oh, good save. Excellent header. Well, another corner, hot on the heels of the last one. And over it comes. Oh, splendid header, but a fine save. Well, another corner kick conceded. Let's see what they do this time. Keen to take it short here. Mortensen. Mastery of the passing game. Crossing opportunity. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. And so it is, the first half story has been written. Well, he's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Stuart? Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. So back underway here, into the second half. Well, they continue their push for the equaliser, but definitely not forcing it. How about the cross? And the danger is averted. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. In behind for him to chase. Well, they couldn't quite muster a real threat. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress.
Bisek. Well, danger here as he runs at them. Oh, lovely ball. And he's apparently veered into an offside position, Stuart. Well, that's tight, really tight. But he was just too anxious to make his run. He was in, though. teammates available and let's give credit to the defending can they do something positive on the counter-attack and he's got the beating of his opponent well on the final analysis it was good defending and the referee blows the whistle it is a free kick Now to the front post. Regained possession. Well, that is how to play advantage. Anderson. Wonderfully weighted pass. Defended well. Getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. Nikolai Paulsen. Can he finish this? And that's an excellent piece of defending to thwart him. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Well, getting it forward, but they need an equaliser. Well, it petered out. The inside route looks promising. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Must be! And a goal! They lead by two now. And that allows them to breathe a bit more easily. Well, I have to say, he's done really well here. He's in the right place and then a decent finish. That's a good goal. And the ball is moving again. 2-0 is how it stands. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. A foul, but advantage played. Just the challenge that was required. Well, foul play, says the referee. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. And there it is, the final whistle. Not what the home fans were hoping for before a ball was kicked today. Defeat for them. Well, Derek, they weren't at their best today, both as individuals and as a team. And they didn't deserve anything from the game. Need a much better display next time out. Well, as we run the rule over this man's work, positive after positive, Stuart. 
Well, it's a good performance. He worked hard, played well and scored a goal. And his team won. What more could you ask for?